well you're a sports fan, tonight was a very efficient sort of night as the Rainbow Guinea volleyball team came in and took care of business quickly with a straight set win over UC Riverside. Hawaii used a pair of long runs in the first set to jump out to an early lead over the Highlanders and scored nearly at will against Riverside. Hawaii jumped out to a 14-3 lead before Riverside was able to score consecutive points in the set. Hawaii also served very well in the set, backing up four service aces, including two by setter Mita Uriata. Hawaii who set the rally scoring record for fewest points allowed in a set with five last Friday nearly did it again, taking the first set 25 to 7. The second set was almost a carving copy of the first. Once again, Hawaii dominated, grabbing a big early lead. Hawaii kept up their hot serving, hitting three more service aces against the Highlanders, including a pair by outside hitter Emily Hartong. Hawaii also got their block going in the second set, collecting four combined blocks and two solo blocks, for a total of four team blocks in the set. Hawaii was never really threatened in the second set, coming away with a 25-13 victory. In the third set, Riverside was able to stay a little bit closer, but mostly because head coach Dave Shoji went to his bench mode. As a result, Riverside was able to compete a little better against the reserves, but Hawaii's bench played nearly as well as the starters. Hawaii continued to dominate at the net picking up another four blocks in the final set, including two solo blocks by Kayla Goodman, one of the reserves who sparkled off the bench. In the end, Hawaii finished off the sweep with a 25-15 victory. After the match, the players reflected on the way that they were able to play tonight. So we kind of try to focus on our own side and, you know, producing our own energy. Um, in which we did so, we were pretty efficient, so I'm pretty proud of my team. Uh, we knew that they didn't have a very good record, and um, but we didn't really want to underestimate them too much because we know how we can play sometimes when we're just complacent throughout the match. So we came out strong and just kind of wanted to finish the match with urgency and make sure that they didn't really come in. Hawaii will now head out for its first conference road trip of the season to take on Long Beach State and UC Irvine on Friday and Saturday. Be sure to follow Kaleo on Twitter for live game updates and final recaps of the matches. Reporting for Kaleo o Hawaii, I'm Jeremy Nathan.